Hello, welcome to another episode of A Manic Odyssey and this DBT journey. This video, we're looking at troubleshooting when what you're doing isn't working for interpersonal effectiveness. The first question we ask is, do I have the skills I need? Review what has already been tried. Ask yourself, do I know how to be skillful in getting what I want? Do I know how to say what I want to say? Do I follow the skill instructions to the letter? The second question we'll ask ourselves is, do I know what I really want in this interaction? Ask yourself, am I understanding what I really want in this interaction? Am I unsure of my priorities? Am I having trouble balancing asking for too much versus asking for too little? Or saying no to everything versus saying yes to everything? Is fear or shame getting in the way of knowing what I really want? The third question we'll use to troubleshoot is, are short-term goals getting in the way of long-term goals? Ask yourself, is now, now, now winning out over getting what I really want in the future? Is emotion mind controlling what I say and do instead of wise mind? The fourth question we ask is, are my emotions getting in the way of using my skills? Ask yourself, do I get too upset to use my skills? Are my emotions so high that I am over my skills breakdown point? The fifth question we ask is, are worries, assumptions, and myths getting in my way? Ask yourself, are thoughts about bad consequences blocking my action? Thoughts like, they won't like me or she will think I'm stupid. Are thoughts about not deserving things getting in my way? Thoughts like, I'm such a bad person, I don't deserve this. Am I calling myself names that stop me from doing anything? Thoughts such as, I won't do it right, or I'll probably fall apart, or I'm so stupid. Do I believe myths about interpersonal effectiveness? Thoughts like, if I make a request, this will show that I'm a weak person, or only wimps have values. The last question we ask ourselves when troubleshooting is, is the environment more powerful than my skills? Ask yourself, are the people who have what I want or need more powerful than I am? Are other people more in control of the situation than I am? Will others be threatened if I get what I want? Do others have reasons for not liking me if I get what I want? When you find yourself continually running into an interpersonal block or wall, it can be very helpful to come back to these questions and answer them to the best of your ability, checking the facts as you go. Next video, we'll look at the overview of building relationships and ending destructive ones. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share these videos and skills with anyone you believe will benefit from them. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.